you know, there's there's fishing rounds uh, about half an hour away from the hotel. So it's very convenient and, and people take advantage of that, you know. It's, uh, it's just for a one day fishing trip, it's wonderful. And I've caught some nice white sea bass and calico bass all inside that harbor there. Yes. And then going over to Todos Santos, those reefs like San Miguel, lots of rock fishing there. Yes. So it's a lot of fun. No, it's a great destination. And it's so close to the border. I mean, it's only a little over an hour, and you're in San Diego. Yes, yes. We just got bit on a troll spot. There's a little kelp back there. We got fish boiling right behind the boat. Fish right behind the boat. You can see the little tunas down below there. I don't know if they're skipjack or what they are. Oh, it looks like yellowtail or dorado, too. Right below the boat, we see them all there. Let's see what I got here. There's a lot of fish right below the boat here. Get a live bait on there, there's a lot of fish. Here he comes. A little yellow tail. There we go, got a yellow tail here. There's a yellow tail, first fish of the day. We got all kinds of fish breaking around the boat. Billy right here, throwing some bait in the water for us. Nice little yellowtail way to start it off. All right, let's get another one. Yellowtail can be found in a wide range, as far north as British Columbia and down south into Chile. We usually find good numbers of them from Point Conception down into the Baja waters. They can grow up to 100 pounds and then they feed on a variety of bait fish, including sardines, mackerel, and even like squids and shrimps too. They're one of the most popular game fish in all of California.